Hello kids, how are you today? Hope you're doing well. Okay, before we're gonna start with our discussion, let's have first reading of vocabularies. Here are the three vocabulary words. The first word is plants. Repeat after me please. Plants. Again, plants. Let's spell the word plants. P-L-A-N-T-S. Plants. Very good. Let's proceed to number two. Number two word is stem. Everybody, stem. Let's spell the word stem. S-T-E-M. Stem. Very good. Now let's proceed to number three. Number three is soil. 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 Let us spell the word soil. S O I L. Soil. Okay, now let's start with our discussion. And our topic for this time it's all about plants. But this is the main topic that we are going to discuss. But our subtopic is parts of the plants okay we will talk about the parts of the plant okay now today we will learn how to identify the different parts of the plant and we are going to study also how to describe or to describe how the different plants parts work so how the how the the parts of the plant works or how they work okay now let's start okay parts of the plant okay I have here a question and can you answer me for a while can you name the parts of the plants? Can you give me some parts of the plants? Mm -hmm. Okay, good job. Now this time, we are going to study the parts of the plants. Okay, the first is roots. Everybody, roots. Let us spell the word roots. R-O-O-T-S. Roots. Okay. And the next one is stem. Everybody, stem. Okay, spell the word stem. S-T-E-M. Stem. Okay, and the third is the leaf or leaves. When we say leaf, that is singular or only one. When we say leaves, it's plural form. Okay, two or more. Now, the next one is flower okay let's spell the word flower f l o w e r flower okay now next the word fruit fruit okay let us spell the word fruit f r u i t fruit now the next one is seeds seeds spell the word seeds s e e D S seeds. Now, do you know where are these uh, parts of the plant is? Okay, let's talk about. Okay, now here we will talk about first the roots. What is the roots? Okay, this is the roots. I have here a picture about the roots. This is the first picture, and the second one is this one. The first picture is the root of a what? A root of a plant. And the second one is the root of a tree, right? Okay, the root is not the same. But the function of the roots, it's the same. Okay, as you look at here in the first picture, the first picture, their roots is too small. And the second picture, their roots is too big, right? 
Okay. Now, what is the function the function of these roots? Okay. The first function function of these roots is roots hold the plants in the soil. So the root the the uh, the work of the plants uh, the roots I mean is to hold the plants in the soil. Okay. They are the one who holds the plants so that it will not what? It will not easily fall down, right? Okay. And the other one is they act like straws. Okay, you know what is straws? Same like you are drinking a cola and you use it uh, just like a thing that you use it to zip. That is a straw. Okay. That is the same as like a roots. Why? Because the roots, they absorb water and nutrients from the soil. So, not only holding the plants in the soil, but also they are, uh, they work and they absorb water and nutrients from the soil. Okay, that is the work of the roots okay how about the next one the next one is the stem okay do you know where's the stem of the plants okay this is the stem of a plant this one the stalk okay and another one is this one okay that is called stem okay now what is the uh, what is the work of the stem the stem supports the plants okay without stem plant will die okay that's why every part of the of the plants is so important right okay and another one is it carries water and nutrients from the roots to different uh, to the different parts of the plants so it means the stem is the second uh, receiver of the nutrients and water from the roots. They are the one who deliver, deliver the water and nutrients from the soil going to their different parts of the plants. Okay, that is the work of the stem. Okay, and the other one is the stem of the tree is called trunk okay we call it trunk the, the stem of the tree is a trunk okay always remember that one the stem of the tree is called trunk okay remember that okay and the next one is do you know what's this what part of the plant is this is the leaves okay now what is leaves and what is the work of the leaves now leaves capture sunlight to make food for the plants okay so in the leaves plants make food right okay and that process is called what that is called photosynthesis okay photosynthesis is a process on how the plants make food right okay the process is called photosynthesis okay and the next do you know what part of the plants is this okay i know you know it know, know it already okay this is the flowers very good now what is the function or what is the work of the flower? Okay, flower, they are the reproductive part of most plants. Okay, okay. Flower is or are the reproductive parts of the plants. So it means uh, they are the one who can, uh, they are one factor of uh, like making another plants okay so now 
Do you know uh, what do we call the colored part of the flower? So, we will talk about this one. Their petals are colorful to attract insects. Again, their petals are colorful to attract insects. Now, have you seen that colored part of the plants having color violet, color uh, blue, red, white, sometimes like that, yellow? That part of the part of the flower is called petals. Okay, so this is called the petals, the colored part of the plant, and that petals is the use of that petal is to attract the insect okay when the insect saw that petal so attractive so they will go there and they will get some what they will get some nectar in the uh, in that uh, flower and so that the flower will bloom so beautiful right okay that is the uh, work of the flowers now next the seeds okay this is the, an example of a of a plants or of, of a fruit that have seed okay a watermelon a kiwi and a peach and another example is the papaya as you see the block spot inside the fruit is called the seeds now what is the work or what is the function of this seed now seeds are the part of the plant that make new plants okay always remember the work of the seed is to germinate so it means it's to uh it's to make new plants they are the one the the one uh, factor that the plants make another plants the seeds and when they germinate or germinate means start to grow they will develop into new plants because of that seed right okay that is the function of the seed okay always remember that one Okay, now, let's see what you learned. Okay, did you understand? Okay, this is, uh, uh, this is another uh, explanation about the parts of the plants. What are those parts of the plants? First is the roots, the stem, the leaves, the flower, uh, and the fruit and the seed, right? That is the part of the plants okay now this time let's have first our activity time okay now this time kindly open your book in science subject on page number 11 and 12 and we will answer activity number one and activity number two now for activity number one says there label the plants okay you are going to label the parts of the plants okay i have here a picture in your book and then you are the one who label what part of the plant is that okay did you understand okay good job now for activity number two Another one, kindly open your book again in science subject on page number 11 and 12. And let us proceed to activity number two. For activity number two, complete the words. Okay, there are four words there that you are, you gonna complete it. You gonna write what is the missing letter in that word. Okay, now the first word is, what is that? F blank blank W blank blank so that is one part of the plant okay now next L blank 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 E blank what's that 
Okay. And the next one is blank E blank blank S. Okay. There is another part of the plant. And the last one blank blank O blank blank. Okay, what's that? Okay, so that's all. After you answer your book, kindly take a photo, take a photo, and then after that, send it in our line group. Now, all I say, stay home, stay safe, and stay healthy. Have a nice day, everyone. Goodbye.